Then the home visitor goes to see the family. Hi, we are now with Anne McElhenney, Program Manager of Welcome Every Baby. How are you? Fine, thank you. We're glad Fine, to have you on our show today. I'm very happy to be here today. Good. It's so important for our community to have programs that help babies and small children, like Welcome Every Baby. So I would like to start by telling our viewers what is the mission of this program. Well, let me read our mission statement to provide screening, education, support, and referral services to all infants and their families in Santa Barbara County through comprehensive, family-centered, voluntary, and culturally appropriate services. The purpose of Welcome Every Baby is to help support parents in bringing their children into our communities. We feel that the health of a community starts in the first relationship, which is between the mother and the infant. And when that attachment and relationship is healthy, that child carries that health and resilience all through their lives. What is the history behind this program? The history, ah, it's Prop 10, it's tobacco tax money, which the voters um, back in May decided, voted to keep um, for funding for programs like this. It's money that's for funding programs for children birth to five, acknowledging that the most brain growth and the most influential years in a child's development are the first five years. The First Five Commission was very interested in having some sort of home visiting program and we finally came up with this newborn home visiting program that was universal, offered to everybody in the, in the county. Let's talk about the structure of the program. How does it work? The mothers find out about Welcome Every Baby either from their friends, neighbors, or in the hospital when they have their baby. They sign a consent in the hospital. The nurse goes out to see the family initially within about um, 72 hours of the mom getting home. That's the goal, mm. a little earlier if possible. Then the home visitor goes to see the family when the baby's about three weeks to a month old then calls again at two months, visits again at four months, another call at around six months, and then a final visit at nine months. And these time periods are critical times in the development of the baby when questions come up, when changes start to happen and questions come up. So that's why we chose those times to do the visits. Which are the main milestones that you look for in babies? Let's say from zero to nine months. We look at all the domains of development in the infant. So we're looking at motor development, language development, and regulation, which is the baby's ability to stay calm when things get exciting. And we also look at their social development. Critically, what we look at is the, the relationship between the mom and the baby. This is the critical thing that we like to support through Welcome Every Baby, is, is the attachment, because that's where all the learning takes place, is within this relationship with the parent. And then later in life, within any relationship, that's where learning happens. Now, what happens when you find a case that is irregular, like a behavior that is not normal for a baby or in the mother? Well, we talk about it. Um, we talk about it with the mother. We describe what typical behavior would look like. Mention that we're finding that this baby or something's going on between the two of them that is not typical and then we encourage the mother to talk to her pediatrician about this behavior we give her resources in the community where she can go to address these things so if it's developmental delays that we notice we'll talk to the mom about early start which is special education for infants and toddlers with disabilities mm -hmm. But we always refer the mom back to the pediatrician when there's any questions about um, development or concerns. Good. Now tell me more about the staff members. We have registered nurses mm -hmm. and the home visitors, we call them home visitors, they're all child development specialists. They've all had, they've all got a, at least a BA degree and are educated in child development. 
most of our staff has been doing this for the whole time that the program's been running, which is almost seven years, so um, they're very experienced. They have a very good eye for being able to see all the nuances of child development and relationship with the mom. Good. And talking about relationship with the mom, I know you encourage parents to go out with children, and there are some community activities out there that um, are linked with some of your nurses, right? Some of the nurses, some of the home visitors, a couple of our child development specialists teach classes at adult ed here mm -hmm. in Santa Barbara anyhow. Infant Times is one of them and one's Toddlers in the Park. So we do encourage moms to get together with other moms and babies because at being isolated in their role as a mother can be pretty hard on a mom. It can lead to some depression. Some moms, when they have their babies at a little later age, They've been in the workforce and they're, they're used to having a lot of social input or social activity, but it's not around being a mother. So when they become a mother, it feels kind of isolating. So we do encourage them to get out there. And thanks for all that information. And lastly, could you leave us with some contact information in case people need uh, to hear more from your program? Certainly. We have a website. It's welcomeeverybaby.org. The E and welcome is the same E as in every, so it's like welcome very baby. The phone number in South County is 898-2229. And the phone number in North County is 922-5459. If you move into the county with a baby that's younger than nine months, you can give a call at either of these numbers and we can start doing visits at any time, at any age of your baby. We also do home visits for foster children, for adopted children, for children born at home, children brought in from out of the state. Every child. Every child. That's why it's called Welcome Every Baby. <laughs> well, thank you for all that information. I wish the best for you and the program. Well, thank you very much. For more information on the Nonprofit Spotlight, check our website at www.sbchannels.tv.